just leveled up, I heard the beep. The beep? No, the noise, I heard the ding ling ling. power in creation to shape a life turn it toward happiness or despair her children were to be ours raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies I won't be moved by sympathy no matter who you bring into this confrontation Liara is here because she wants to be not because I asked her to and because she's a powerful biotech what have you told her about me Liara what could I say, Mother? That you're insane? Evil? Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I can't believe you'd kill your own daughter. I now realize I should have been stricter with her. This is gonna hurt. Just leveled up, I heard the beep. The beep? No, the noise. I heard the ding ling ling. Noise of a level up, which we will just take a quick moment in this battle to do. Hmm. Charm, all the way please, and combat armor, nearly all the way, cool, continue, it's alright, we can continue our battle. Ouch, that was a big explosion. Ow. Venezia, you're getting a bit weak. Well, you're weakening yourself, you silly woman. God, the frame rate hates this. I went pink! <laughs> wonder what it was that got me that made me go pink. Hmm. Oh, great star. Fine, I have to stop. I have to run the other way around then. the first part of the battle done. This is not over. Saren is unstoppable. My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. The Rachni didn't cooperate with you. Why should I? I will not betray him. You will. You... You must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. So you could turn on me again? Yes, but it would not be my will, Shepard. People are not themselves around Saren. You come to idolize him, worship him. You would do anything for him. The key is Sovereign, his flagship. It is a dreadnought of incredible size, and its power is extraordinary. Sovereign's not like other ships. Where did it come from? I cannot say. The Geth did not build it. Its technology is far more advanced than that of any known species. Da -da -da -da. Stay aboard. The more Saren's will seems correct. You sit at his feet and smile as his words pour into you. It is subtle at first, 
I thought I was strong enough to resist. Instead, I became a willing tool, eager to serve. He sent me here to find the location of the Mu Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. Someone on Novaria found it? Two thousand years ago, the Rachni inhabited that region of our galaxy. They discovered the Relay. The Rachni can share memories across generations. Queens inherit the knowledge of their mothers. I took the location of the Relay from the Queen's mind. I was not gentle. You can still make it right. Give me the information. I was not myself, but I should have been stronger. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take it, please. Knowing the Relay's coordinates is not enough. Do you know where he planned to go from there? Saren wouldn't tell me his destination. But you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You sh You should... Oh, you should... Mother, I... Don't leave! Fight him! You've always made me proud, Liara. Die! Bit of a 180, alright. Matriarch Venezia. And she did. I cannot go on. You will have to stop him, Shepard. Hold on. We've got Metagel. Maybe we can... No. He is still in my mind. I am not entirely myself. I never will be again. Mother. Good night, little wing. I will see you again with the dawn. They always said there would be a... <sighs> right, well... Armor, full master shield, master shield boost, upgrade first aid, quick save before we forget. This one serves as our voice. We cannot sing. Not in these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. Musics? What? Your way of communicating is strange. Flat. It does not color the air. When we speak, one moves all. This is going to be a fun conversation. We are the 
Mother, we sing for those left behind, the children you thought silenced. We are Rachni. How are you speaking through her? Our kind sing through touchings of thought. We pluck the strings, and the other understands. She is weak to urging. She has colors we have no names for. But she is ending. Her music is bittersweet. It is beautiful. The children we birthed were stolen from us before they could learn to sing. They are lost to silence. End their suffering. They cannot be saved. They will only cause harm as they are. I don't understand. Why are your children killing people? These needlemen. They stole our eggs from us. They sought to turn our children into beasts of war. Claws with no songs of their own. Our elders are comfortable with silence. Children know only fear if no one sings to them. Fear has shattered their minds. I understand. A child left alone in a closet until she is 16 would not be sane. If you're sure they can't be saved. It is lamentable, but necessary. Do what you must. Before you deal with our children, we stand before you. What will you sing? Will you release us? Are we to fade away once more? There are acid tanks rigged up on that thing. Set them off. Millions of my ancestors died to put these things down. Don't let them come back. They made a mistake. They let the Krogan go too far. This is a chance for us to atone. She has done nothing to us. Your companions hear the truth. You have the power to free us, or return our people to the silence of memory. Yeah, right, what are we gonna do? I won't destroy your entire race. You'll go free. Are you stupid? Your people didn't fight these bastards, so maybe you don't get it. Are we any better if we kill them all? Do what you want. My people will clean up this mess later, just like we did for the Solarians. You will give us the chance to compose anew? We will remember. We will sing of your forgiveness to our children. Great. Bugs are writing songs about you. Mark my words, you'll regret this. Right, well, oh, getting there, right, well, we have to get out of here. I think I went the wrong way. Oh no, we got this. Yeah, we do go this way. Summon the elevator. Quick save. So close to the end of this mission. It's going to be just over two hours, like I thought. So. Moving on. Uh, 
Are you here to secure the situation? How are you holding up? You must listen to me. If we do not contain our mistake, they will drop bombs from the battle stations. You understand? You let these things out? Uh, I am only following the orders. Binary Helix found an egg. It was on a derelict ship, thousands of years drifting. This was Rachni's ship. Inside they find many eggs in cryogenic suspension. A thousand-year-old egg hatched? Yes. Very tough to be so long frozen. That it survived the centuries. This is miraculous. Binary Helix plan to clone Rachni. Mass produce them. Create an army. But when they get here, they find this egg is not a common Rachni. It is a queen. After she lays eggs, they move her to Rift Station. They are thinking that without her, they can raise the babies to be obedient. Obviously, they were wrong. Ah, this was exactly the wrong thing to do. I am thinking that without a queen, Rachni do not develop properly. Her mind is shaping theirs. These Rachni are uncontrollable. Then all we need to do is bring her here. No, I am sorry. But this will not work. These Rachni are beyond saving. It is a sad thing, but they must be euthanized. <sighs> I am thinking that the Neutron Purge must be set off. How do we set off the Purge? Arming controls are nearby. All you do is insert the key. Then uh, I will give Mira destruct. <laughs> well then. Quick save, just in case. Oh, what I think. What I'm scared might happen does. So connecting. I have full access to the facility and am at your disposal. Activate the neutron purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. Code input 8750200079. Code Omega local execution. Verify. Code Omega execution in 120 seconds. There's a lot. You can, if you're lucky, just run. And I'm just doing that. something journal right let's go back to the Normandy What's our next move, Commander? Head for the Mew Relay? The Mew Relay could link to dozens of systems. Unless we know exactly where Saren's going, we'd just be wasting our time. Game with the creek chat. Commander chair. is right. We cannot rush off blind. We still need to learn more about Saren. Who put you in charge? Did the Commander resign when I wasn't looking? 
We're all on the same team here, Williams. She's just trying to help. Sorry, Commander. Look, this is a tough mission. We're all on edge. Everyone go get some rest. Crew dismissed. Novaria report is away, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Is this report accurate, Commander? You found Rachni on Novaria? And then released the Queen. Do you have any idea what you've done? How many generations until they overrun the galaxy? This Queen is different. She understands why her kind had to be wiped out last time around. I hope you're right, Shepard. My children's children will pay the price if you're not. Why didn't you just say grandchildren? It's the same thing. Alright. Before we end looking at the time on the recording and the space left on the laptop, yeah. We will just talk to um Liara. And then end it. If you are here to talk about Benezia's death, you need not bother. She brought it upon herself. Don't pretend it doesn't bother you. She was your mother. She was. But she was not. I prefer to remember Benezia as she used to be. Before she was corrupted by Sovereign's power. The best of your mother lives on in you. Her determination, her intelligence, her strength. That is kind of you to say. I appreciate your concern, but I am fine. Benezia chose her path, just as I have chosen mine. I am with you until the end, Shepard. I like talking with you, Liara. No matter what the subject. You have been very understanding with me, Shepard. Very patient. I appreciate that. I know there are some strange beliefs about my people. I am familiar with the legend of Asari promiscuity. But those rumors have little basis in fact. When one of my people joins with an individual from another species, it is a very deep and spiritual exchange. We do not enter lightly into a union. You make it sound almost mystical. A true union goes far beyond an ordinary melding. It is a connection that transcends the physical universe. Two become one. Thoughts and senses merge, identities intertwine. Memories and emotions weave themselves together, becoming entangled in a single, rapturous whole. It is unlike any other experience. In some cases, it can be a truly life-changing event. Are you propositioning me, Smith? It sounds amazing. Are you saying... No! Oh, no! Uh, I am not very good at this, am I? I'm sorry, Shepard. I am trying to explain why I have been so... reserved. The Union is more than just sex. It is the lifeblood of my species, the way we Asari evolve and grow as a society. That is why I have never... Uh, I mean, that is why we must choose our partners with great care. I want you to be absolutely sure about this, Liara. I am only 106. Barely an adult by Asari standards, and I spend most of my time absorbed in my research. I never really thought about it. Not until I met you. You are very special to me, Shepard. But with all that's happened, Saren, the Geth, the Reapers, I do not know if we are ready for this. These are dark times, Liara. Maybe once all this is over. I'm glad you understand, Shepard. There is too much at stake. We need to put aside our personal feelings and focus on stopping Saren. I wish it did not have to be that way. But we all have to make sacrifices. Let's let's talk about something else. Let's not sing because it's been two hours and eleven minutes. Right. Okay. What we'll do. 
Clarepinus, see if there's anything useful. No equipment. Da -da -da -da. Tsunami 4. Nope. Right. Okay. Let's go down to the engineering part. Down to the bowels of the ship. I'm ready for the next session. Which will be when I next record. <laughs> oh. Alright, I'll just have a quick look to see if he's got anything interesting. Let's see what you got. You bet, Commander. Titan 7. 6, sorry. Titan 6. Very expensive. I'm trying to get a bit more money. The Phoenix Six, Titan Six, Scorpion Four, just going to have a quick. No. We'll keep the Ursa. Armor. Right, well. I think now is a good time to end it. Thank you for watching. As always, I have been Jimbo Jones. And for me, Jessica Shepard. And Garrus, who I believe was doing something just before I came here. I say goodbye. Bye.